I so now we are going to see how to use ready buttons so let's open this document here add new employee and uh, first let's change the size of our main porter pin to for example um, let's see 530 and this grid pin to 200 Control S I think it uh, look nice now. So let's add a new row here. Then add some label. name it gender then I'm going to add uh, first let's add uh, horizontal box let's first add our radio buttons Then select horizontal box, make the alignment to center left, and the spacing 20 like this. So let's change the name of first one to male and the next one to female. So now if you run you see you cannot uh, this is wrong because we want to select male the female is uh, deselected and the same for some other button so we need to create a toggle group so it will be let's name it go to toggle group here and for example gender and the same for male the same group gender and save run so if you select male female so now it's work fine and let's make male is selected so you run you find it selected already next I need to add variable for them so at fx male private the button mail button private email button. and let's import that's it then save and now all I need to do is go to my add new employee again and go to mail Good. and select ID to male and the same for female Control S that's it so if you run this app now you see it work nice so that's it for ready button. See you 
next video. Goodbye.